thing to add a bit of colour and fun to your table without outlaying a great expense. So I'm going to go through a few of my favourite ideas today and show you them in action. So here we go. So the first one is herbs. Why not pop a herb on each person's place setting, add their name on a tag, and there you go, really easy place setting, adds a great colour and fragrance to your table, and is also a little gift that your guests can take away with them. So you could scatter them around the table, a different herb per person, and it will really will add some texture, and I said a beautiful smell to the table. So there we go, herbs wrapped in brown paper, really easy. which would be great for a high tea or an afternoon tea with ladies, is why not put a little piccolo, a little champagne bottle or a little wine bottle on each person's place setting. Pop their name on these really easy and affordable um, cardboard luggage tags that you can pick up from your news agents. A bit of raffia um, and pop that at each person's table. Once again, it's something that they can take home and will add a great little element to the table. Another idea I love for um, place settings, particularly for things like high teas, are these little mini blackboard easels. Once again, you can pick these up from your craft store or discount store just for a couple of dollars. Just a little cardboard, a little wooden, I should say, blackboard easel. Write the person's name on and pop that at each place setting. There we go. The great thing about these is you can reuse them. Um, you can use them for food tags if you've got a, a buffet or a smorgasbord happening at an event, um, or use them for name tags. So really great little idea. It's two dollars fifty for three there. So little mini blackboard easels. Oops, there we go. I can get them standing up. Um, just a couple of dollars and a great idea. I like to do with place cards is make the item more than just a name on a piece of card. So why not actually use some beautiful vintage paper like this, write the person's name, but actually write them a note inside and place them on each table setting. So it means that not only do they know where they're sitting, but they've actually got a lovely personalised note from you as their host and a little takeaway gift. There's lots of great paper shops um, that you can get things from. Like this, once again, get some lovely card, write their names and a lovely note. And it'll really add a talking point to your table and a lovely memento for your guests to take away. really easy idea for place cards makes turns it a little bit on its head is instead of writing people's names on their place cards why not actually put an old photo of them. This is a great idea particularly if it's something like a Mother's Day lunch and you could put a photo with um, the mum in um, who's the guest of honour with each guest and that's where they know where to sit. So you can buy these frames fairly cheap um, and pop some lovely old photos in. This is my mum here with her family, so if that was on the table, she would know that that's her place setting. It'll be a great talking point at your table and also a lovely memento that your guests can take away. You can have lots of fun having recent photos, older photos, mixing them up. It means that people will have to go around the photo, find themselves, around the table I should say, find themselves in the photo and, um, and start reminiscing as well. So really easy idea, photo frames for place settings. idea for a place setting and once again a little treat that people can take home is why not bundle up some old photos, some old family photos or photos of friends that, um, that the people might be interested in. So I've got a group of photos here um, and this is for my mum's place setting and the first photo is a picture of her parents on their wedding day. So I've got some old vintage photos there that I've printed off. This is easily done at your local photo store on your own printer tied them together with a bit of ribbon and that will be on her place setting. The next place setting for Dad will have photos from his childhood of his parents and it will change depending on the guest. It's a really lovely idea. Once again a talking point, people can open up the photos, start to look at them, share their photos and memories with other people at the table and a lovely take home gift for, the, for your guests. Lots of 
great place card ideas to use at your next event, whether it's a brunch, a high tea, a dinner. They're not only great ways to help people find where they're sitting at the table, but will also provide a lovely little take-home gift, um, create a talking point, lots of laughs and lots of memories to share. They're all very easy ideas, very affordable, um, and I know that they will make a memorable event for you and your guests. So thank you for joining us and we look forward to seeing you next time.